J.J. Tartaglia III And I'm Zach Slaughter, Esquire Special event for me, we must have We're here to talk to you about the third masterpiece by Skullfist, of course And what title is that? Zach Slaughter? Way of the Road Oh, it sounds delicious You got the pleasure Well, people have been asking us where we've been the last four years And, well, to tell you the truth Perhaps maybe we've been investing a little bit of money. Mm, yes, into the market, of course. It's a very marketable place, isn't it? Yes. <laughs> yes, and how much money have we made off them, JJ? Oh, no, too much. Too much, yes, too much. <laughs> but I've got desire. The new album features nine tracks of pure elegance and mastery. Track one, you belong to me. It is a song of possession. Track two, no more running. A song of desperation, anxious anxiety, inflaming the heart. Track three, I am a slave. A song of anger, of pain and torment of the modern world, its modern life and its Unabated ability to crush our spirits! Yes! We gotta take these things off. This is retarded. Yes, I please. Yeah, I'm done. Okay. <laughs> Track 2. It was pointless trying to be Victorian. Uh, the new record is really raw. I think it's really raw. It's just, we wanted, the last second Skullfist record, Chasing the Dream, was such a high production. There was so much shit on it, you know? Like, it, it was drenched in reverb, and it was really cool, and I, I love the way it came out, but this time around we wanted to do the exact opposite. And aside from people telling me my vocal sounded like Cher, uh, this time I decided to just do one <laughs> vocal track. Um, and uh, hopefully that's enough to make a gold record, perhaps. Oh, oh, oh. Astonishing! The chain reaction. Yeah, it's a more stripped down approach. Um, the drums are raw, the bass is raw, everything. We didn't overproduce anything, it's just straight sounds from the instruments. And uh, yeah, that's the way she goes. In fact, dubious! Yes, indubitably! Do you concur? Sir, I do incur, indeed! <laughs> but the new uh, the album cover reflects the tracks, man. You know, everything is raw, everything is kind of toned down. Like, a, I don't know, like a more natural sound, man. Like giving a water birth, you know? Totally natural. Like a water baby. We shot the album cover right outside JJ's house, actually. Well, apartment, house. It's a complex. Yeah. It's actually a mansion. I think JJ is actually a drug dealer. I'm not really sure why he always has more money than I do. We also jam there, so... And the, the van was actually broke down. Um, it, we had to push it around <laughs> <We> did, <in laughs> to fact, take those we, shots. Absolutely, yeah. we had to push the van, yeah. Uh, so the van is retired, and it was a nice way to retire the van by using it uh, for the album cover. We had a lot of fun using that van. I lived in that van for a while, and uh, JJ used to masturbate in that thing <laughs> like crazy all the time. All the time. <laughs> It's awkward. It's getting weird. <laughs> yeah, we wanted to get away from the typical artwork of, you know, some illustration that doesn't really have anything to do with us and uh, just go with the raw approach of, hey, this is a photograph, this is us, this, this is what it is, just like the music. Um, this is the naked truth. Yeah. <laughs> this is what Skullfist has been hiding from all these years and finally we found ourselves. 
Oh, 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 yes. Oh. Perhaps some more wine, oh, sir. More wine. more wine. Yeah, you'll notice the, uh, the logo isn't like plastered on the album cover. Like, uh, it's there. You just see it in the background, like on the van. And like, we've always liked like album covers that just, you know, they don't even have the name on it. You know, it's just, uh, you see it like uh, Led Zeppelin 4 or. Uh, Copyright? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> or something like that, you know? Yeah, it's fun. I mean, I, I, it's cool. It's fun to try different things. It's fun to do different stuff. Uh, I think the fourth Skullfest album will probably just be us with didgeridoos. And so <laughs> what? I mean, so what? Why not? JJ can learn how to... That guy's got powerful lungs. Incredibly powerful lungs. I went for a jog with him once in Sao Paulo. And that he ran. Is. He ran for so long. That I actually fell because I was so fucking tired. I was so tired that I fell, literally collapsed on the ground. The new record is a stripped down version of Skull Fist. It's just like a, a, a more a more stripped down version of Skull Fist. That's it, you know? We're not, we're not making a statement or anything. We're just doing what we feel like doing when we feel like, like I don't know, you just make a record and you say, fuck, yeah. what do I want it to sound like this time? I don't know. Well, let's try this. You know, this is fun. We did this super 80s sound. Well, let's try it. I mean, we're always going to sound the same. The band is always going to be the same band. You're always going to know what Skullf is because I sound like a little girl and he hits like a man. So you're always going to know that it's Skullf is. So with the new record, it's the same thing. You know that it's Skullf is. Hopefully, we haven't ripped off any of our old riffs yet. I don't think we're ripping ourselves off yet at this point, but you know that it's Skullf is. And just buy it because I don't have any fucking money. Dude, I'm literally broke. I have no money. He has all the money. Look, you can tell he has all the money. Look how clean his hair is. His hair is fucking clean. Give me the money! <laughs> Our label asked us to make this video to uh, help with the promo. So, Flory, if you're watching this, here you go, buddy. See you right on Flory. See you at the next gig. I, I feel like they asked us to make this video because the records, they haven't sold. We haven't sold any of them yet. Yeah. You guys seen the copy. We haven't sold anything. You know how many likes, to dislikes there are? A lot. All of them. Why isn't the record selling? Just, just buy the record, and then, and then we're not gonna have any no, but, problems. Yeah, they, we've been telling them to buy the record. You guys know to buy the record. Why isn't it selling, JJ? If we buy the records, if we then... buy the record, you know what? We don't need you to buy. You want to buy the record? Buy the record. You don't want to buy the record? Don't buy the record because we'll buy them ourselves. All right? We'll buy the record ourselves. Yeah. <laughs> I feel like this is going to be cringy, but it's okay. Yeah. <laughs>